What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Power Play with CJ. It's going to focus in on the uh, Colorado Avalanche. Naming uh, Jared Bednar, their new head coach. Obviously, Patrick Roy stepped down a uh, couple weeks ago, and now they have Bednar coming in. Bednar was uh, head coach of the uh, Columbus affiliate for the last two years, uh, Lake Erie, where they won it this year. Uh, they won the, the Calder Cup, and for that, uh, in Springfield, Massachusetts with the Falcons. A um, lot of minor league experience, coaching experience. Was an assistant uh, with the, well, coach in South Carolina, Charleston, with the Stingrays for seven years. Graduated to the AHL. Uh, was in Abbotsford, Peoria, and then Springfield, and then obviously like Gary last season. So he's definitely paid his dues. He's a guy that, you know, they... Got the most out of a you know pretty good collection of talent last year in Lake Erie. I mean they got a shot in the arm with Warenski coming in from Michigan at the beginning of the playoffs or end of the regular season beginning of the playoffs. But you know I think he's a good fit for this team. You know I, I my previous driving point was I'd want to see a veteran coach kind of hold it down for a year or two and then you know go after a, a new you know young face, fresh blood, whatever you want to call it. Um, and you know they, they elected to uh, you know give a guy his first NHL coaching job is what it is. Again, I, I think he's going to do a good job. I think he's shown he can work with young players. Um, but I, I, I would have liked to have seen like a, a Kevin Deneen type. And again, I'm a huge Kevin Deneen fan, so maybe I'm biased there. But um, yeah, I would like to have seen a guy like that at the helm, you know, for the next couple of years. But you know, it is what it is. And uh, again, I think Ben and I will be. Uh, you know, a, a good fit with this, this organization, and, you know, I don't think he's, I think he's obviously going to be in a different capacity in the role walks. I think he's just going to focus on the head coaching duties where Rua had final say in the off the ice matters. I think take, getting rid of that dichotomy between, you know, the front office and the coaching staff and having the, co the head coach have a foot in the door in the front office, I think will help Colorado in terms of the personnel decisions. Um, won't help him, but help the process. Make it smoother and um, keep internal turmoil to a minimum. So again, I like Bednar. Wouldn't be who I would have hired, just because I think the situation's still too volatile for a first year head coach to walk into. But you know what? If you're a guy like Bednar, you're gonna take your, you know, you're gonna take your first head coaching job with a boy you can get it. So I'm sure it's not the most ideal set of circumstances for him. But eh, what are you gonna do, right? Anyway. That's all I got in this episode of The Power Play with CJ. Stay tuned for episodes for the off-season and beyond. Later, guys.